derive the Bose postulate of quantization of angular momentum we can derive it from de Broglie equation you know according to Bose postulate only those orbits are permitted in which angular momentum of the electron is an integral multiple of h upon 2 pi this is the Bose postulate of quantization of angular momentum m is mass of the electron b is the velocity of the electron and r is the radius of the orbit in which electron is circulating so this is mvr is angular momentum of the electron and it should be integral multiple of h upon 2 pi so this postulate of bohr can be derived from de broglie equation we know according to de broglie electron can behave as a particle as well as wave as it behaves as a wave and you know wave nature of electron is very important it is used in the construction of electron microscope and you know electron microscope that is a very powerful tool in scientific research because it can magnify size of the object to 15 million times imagine magnification to 15 million times that's why it is used to study the structure of the surfaces of the solid and photograph very small objects up to the order of 10 angstrom so if electron is a wave wave move like crust and trough and if two ends of the wave meet then wave is called in phase then there is a regular series of crust and trough and this is the way that electron can move in an orbit so so for the wave to be in phase circumference of the orbit that is 2 pi r is integral multiple of lambda and according to de Broglie equation you know lambda equal to h upon mv so if we put h upon mv instead of lambda it becomes 2 pi r equal to n h upon mv so mv on this side along with r and n h 2 pi in the denominator and scoot that means by using de Broglie equation we can derive the relation de Broglie equation is in agreement with Bohr's postulate of quantization of angular momentum that's it